One of the things I want you to know about Sycamore Springs is that we will never use a synthetic fabric or a synthetic blend. We are very, very particular about the fabric that we use, and we only use natural fibers, cotton, linen, silk, and wools, because that's what was used then. The thing with the synthetics is if you have a gown in synthetic and you get near a fire and something happens, you get overly warm, a little cinder gets on you, that fabric will melt to yourself, and it just does a lot more damage. Um, so you really don't want a synthetic fabric. Make sure everything you have is a natural fiber. We always pre-wash everything. We don't want any shrinkage. We don't want any bleeding. So when we manufacture our clothing, we make very sure that everything is pre-washed and ready for you to go because we know you're going to wear your clothes hard and we want to get the jump on that so you see exactly what you're buying. Plus, there's no shrinkage. We can tell you it doesn't shrink. It shrinks. What I'm going to show you right now is the linens that we use. And this is just a tiny little portion of what we have. We have a beautiful selection of solid colors in different, different weights. This happens to be a good mid-weight that we're using because it's great for petticoats and short gowns and bed gowns and anything you can think of. It's a good, good solid weight. It will wear like iron because that's the nature of linen. We make sure that all our colors are accurate colors. We will not give you something garishly bright because those kind of dyes didn't come along until the aniline dyes later in the mid-1850s where they had a better mordants to set their dyes so you could maintain those bright colors. So we make sure that all their colors are accurate. We have a large selection of checks and stripes, and this is one of the very few linen prints we have. Finding a good linen print is very, very difficult. They just don't make them, and when they make them, I, find, uh, I buy everything I can find, which, believe me, is not very much. And as we were shooting this particular segment, we put these two together and we thought, oh, look, jacket, petticoat, yum. And these linens over here are specialty linens. Everybody loves a good black watch. And look here, ladies and gentlemen, linen. This is a black watch linen. I used to have some several years ago. I used up every bit I had. And just recently, I found a wee bit more, so I bought all they had. So in my stack of stuff, which I've been collecting for 20 years, this is all I have left. In addition to that is this gorgeous indigo. This, again, is a linen, and this will make a fine man's coat. It is beautiful. And the interesting thing is, this is not a weave. This is not an iCat weave. This is actually a print. And you can tell indigo is one of the worst colors you have for bleeding. So it's very, very important to make sure that this will get um, washed probably more than once to get all that dye out because nothing's worse than having a white shirt or a white shift and you take off your gown or your coat and your armpits are blue. We don't want that to happen. So we're going to try and take care of that for you. Here's another beautiful linen. This is a herringbone linen in this stunning, stunning steel blue color. This was a find by Mallory at our last buying trip to New York, which was so much fun. We have to do it again. But you can see the herringbone on this. This will make a stunning, stunning outfit. I can't wait to wait to find just the right person for the right item to make this up because this is going to be fun. So if you don't see something you like, you have to let us know because chances are we have it. I just have to find where it is in my stash.